Sid Zweigbaum down on the field post game with Mustangs head coach Ed Hoddle. Stevenson falls today to Alvern uh, Alfred, twenty nine to six. Coach, uh, you guys got off the bus with a great start. You get that three and out early. You get the drive. Yeah, there was the penalty. Um, it, it just seemed like. Where do you think this game turned the other way uh, against you guys? Well, I think there was you know the, the exchange there late in the second second quarter. Um, you know. It, it's one of those things where we kept having to adjust and adjust and adjust and adjust and adjust. And, you know, with a young football team, particularly on defense, you know, that's that's a tough thing to do. You know, Corey's seen it and just about seen everything at this point. Um, but having to, to continually adjust. And, and, look, they did a nice job being very physical at the point of attack. They did a nice job getting an extra blocker at the point of attack. And, you know, we worked and worked and worked. And, you know, we'd solve it and they'd adjust. So, you know, it was one of those things where, you, you know, we just have to be better. And, and part of that process is, is getting older. Would, I mean, it seemed like you guys did a really good job handling the fakes on defense. It was actually when they threw was the biggest area. You, you know, uh, they don't throw a lot, but when they do, it was very efficient today. Yeah, you know, I think they continued three or four drives, and I think on two or three of those drives, they ended up scoring touchdowns. So, you know, we've got to be better in the in the back end. You know, and the emphasis all week was was the running game. But you know, we try to we try to tell them, hey, look, they, they can still throw the football. And I think, you know, they probably caught us sleeping a little bit back there and. Um, you know, again, young kids, eyes wide trying to find the football and, and, and got us on some play action stuff. Uh, what was it like down on the field? I, I mentioned how windy it was before the game. Obviously, I'm, I'm not down here in the wind. What was it like for you guys trying to throw so much with the wind? I, it was breezy, you know, but, but again, you know, both teams got to play in the wind. So, you know, they, they picked their spots and came up big. And, um, you, you know, I think it was something we were aware of, trying to limit the big shots, you know, into the wind. And, um, you know, so it's just one of those things. We, we've got to be, be able to overcome that. Coach, you guys finished six and five. Uh, you were six and three in conference play this year. How, how do you sum up the season? Well, you know, any chance you get a chance to, to play in the postseason, um, you look at it as, as a success. And and I think it's successful in the sense that, that we got better from a maturity perspective. And, um, you know, we don't graduate a ton of guys. Most of this football team's back next year. So any any chance you have to get better, um, particularly this week, getting you know, a chance to get an extra week of practice. And we talked about that last week. It's, it's, a, it's huge for us. It's big in recruiting. And, um, you know, it's a successful season. Is it where we want to be? No. Um, but I think we've done a pretty good job identifying the areas we need to get better at to, to make a run at it next year. We talked about uh, last week, his, you know, was senior day, but can you just talk a little about some of the guys, you know, that statistically that, that you know, might have records that last a while, Corey and uh, Preston and, uh, and Devin, and how much you're, you're going to miss those guys, their, their production? Sure. I mean, those, those guys are, I mean, first of all, they're phenomenal human beings. Um, they're all going to graduate. You know, they're all really, really good guys, and, and just you know, I couldn't be more proud of them. You know, you get guys like I think Nick Jashare with the start today, you know, has started more games than anybody else. I think he started, you know, 43. I think 42 was the, was the record, or it was 41 or 42, whatever it was. You know, and, and, and for a guy to come in and, and start that many games in a row is phenomenal. You get guys like Kyle Pleat out there, um, you know, battling his, his tail off every Saturday. And, you know, guy got a chance to play this year and, and, and really made the most of it, worked hard. So, you know, as a group, they're just a really, really fun group, and, and we're certainly going to miss them. All right, Coach. Well, thanks a lot. Didn't end the way you guys wanted to, but there's next season. That's it. All right. That was Mustangs head coach, Hoddle. Stevenson falls in the finale 29-16. to